How can you maximize writing efficiency? To answer that, here are some of my favorite tips from writing excuses on getting words written. Broadly speaking, the first thing you need to do is take your writing seriously. In practical terms, this breaks down into three specific practices. The first is to resolve yourself to being focused when you write. It means your mind is on your story, not distracted by other random things. To help with this, find yourself a decent, isolated workspace. Turn off your alert notifications, keep social media closed, and don't let yourself fall into any web browsing rabbit holes. Literally setting a timer for writing time or online time can help keep you on track short term. For longer term motivation, try using a self-prescribed or external deadline to reach certain word counts or for completing a story. The second aspect of taking your writing seriously is to be prepared to persevere through the tough parts. As you're probably well aware, writing isn't easy. It can take a lot of focused time and thinking and keeping your butt in the chair and hands on the keyboard to get those words rolling along. It means you can't just give up after the first 15 minutes if it's not working. You need to focus on pushing through and know that you can always come back and fix it up in post. The third part is to prioritize and commit to your writing times. Every little thing that comes up can't take precedence over your writing, so don't let yourself fall down that slippery slope of continuously putting it off. That being said, sometimes the biggest hurdle is actually the people around you not respecting your need to focus. But if that sounds familiar, know that if you don't take your writing seriously, you can't expect the people around you to either. So. Try setting up a consistent weekly schedule. It can really help to prove your seriousness and hopefully limit interruptions to a minimum. And something to keep in mind when planning when to write is to put creativity first. Most people at the end of the day are too mentally exhausted to start doing creative work. The key is to schedule your writing time before that mental exhaustion sets in. So if that's a luxury you can afford, it should make a huge difference in your writing efficiency. Try waking up early to write, cut out a chunk of your lunch break for writing, or do it first thing in the morning instead of saving it for the end of the day. If writing early simply isn't an option for you, you'll want to find a way to recharge. An activity that can act as a palate cleanser for the brain, refreshing your stock of willpower so you can get your writing done even at the end of the day. It should be something that doesn't work the same muscles as writing, and is relatively short so as not to cut too deep into your writing time. Experiment and find the thing that works for you, because it could be anything from taking a short walk to perhaps playing a first-person shooter. So if you want to maximize your writing efficiency, start by taking your writing seriously. Stay focused, persevere, and prioritize. Do your best to schedule your creative work first, commit to that schedule, and don't be afraid to recharge as needed.